I'm Father Gray, and this is a St. Mary's Minute. Gratitude is something that we know should always be expressed, but sometimes we need a reminder about it. Sometimes we think that what we receive, the good that we receive especially, is somehow due to us, that it is something that is duly given to us because we deserve it, or something like that. And perhaps that is so. But even when, for example, like we pay for something, we still probably should say thank you to the person who has provided it to us. I'm talking about like things as simple as at the convenience store, at the grocery store, at wherever the place we are exchanging money for goods, you know? We still say thank you and you're welcome. It's not just a perform a thing, but also we're expressing a truth here, which is that there is something more than merely the thing that is given that is in play, and more than the thing that is received for the thing that is given, which is the cost. Our human relationships depend upon really appreciating the gifts that we have in each other. There's no place for ingratitude, for example, in our lives as Christians. Everything that we receive is ultimately a grace there are many human graces that we see very easily throughout our lives. These are kind of the material things that are all around us. Um, of course, also the natural things too, but now these are more from God, right? And then there's also those more ephemeral things that we can't necessarily put our finger on, but we know are also truly good. Like, for example, the feeling of being loved, the feeling of happiness. These are much bigger kinds of ideas, and can't just point at it in life and say, that's what happiness is. Gratitude allows us to acknowledge the goodness in something that isn't entirely apparent. Gratitude allows us to look at something and see beyond it, a very simple kind of transcendence that spreads throughout our lives. Gratitude is something that should always be part of us. As we continue in our Easter celebration now, now kind of near to the end, this is one of those things we cannot ever forget that in fact, we must be grateful for so many good things and not in a way that assumes that we deserve them. Our Lord is truly gracious with us and hopefully many people are also gracious with us. These graces are worth our thanks.